In today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to use a whiteboard with any video conferencing app. So first things first, we need to put Manicam into overlay mode. So that appears on the right top hand side of the Manicam screen. And then your menu list will appear on the left side and then you turn on your drawing tool. You can now connect to a variety of different video conferencing solutions such as Skype, Zoom, Teams, WebEx and many more. All you need to do is get on your video call and share your screen. It's super easy. So now we're going to go through the whiteboard tools available to you guys on the Manicam whiteboard. So first things first, we're going to use our drawing tools. So here we have a variety of different colors and you can even adjust the sizing of your writing. So I'm going to use black and I'm just going to write Manicam because I'm not the best writer. There we go. And if I want to erase it, I can use my little eraser tool, but sometimes it's not too efficient. So I just use the little garbage can right here, which erases everything. Next is our text tool so here we have again a variety of different colors sizes and fonts we have our fonts our sizing and if i want to change it to regular bold italic light medium i'm going to keep it to regular and then there we go. i'm going to choose arial because it's a more universal font so i'm going to write here manicam and then i have my little stamping tool which is a little fun feature that we love to include you can also add your own stamp too on the little plus sign so i'm going to start out with the bubble Okay, so then I click the little garbage can and everything erases. So now I'm going to show you guys how to use our highlighting tool. So again, I'm going to go in my text and I'm going to write a manicam and then I'm going to move it with my cursor and then I'm just going to use my highlighter and then I can just highlight over any writing, which is really cool if you want to emphasize certain things for students. And then here I don't mind using my eraser tool just because it's not a lot of writing or a lot of things going on. So there you guys have it. We even have a little section here at the top with three buttons where you have, you can open your file or save your file and always put your whiteboard opacity at the end. So you want the most white. So that's it guys. Hope you enjoyed. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our YouTube channel as well. If there's any other videos that you guys want us to make, please leave us a comment in the comment section down below and then lastly hit the bell button to get notified when we upload brand new videos see you guys next time